For people with access and functional needs and their families, it's important to consider individual circumstances to effectively prepare for emergencies, never relying on luck to save you. When building an emergency kit, consider items you use on a daily basis, as well as life-sustaining items. For example, if you rely on a wheelchair, add spare tires and a portable air compressor to ensure your mobility during an emergency. Create a support network of people who can help you in a disaster. Keep a contact list in a water-resistant container or in your electronic device. Many county emergency management agencies maintain a voluntary registry for people with access or functional needs to receive targeted assistance during emergencies. If you use medical equipment in your home that requires electricity, talk to your healthcare provider about how you can keep everything running during a power outage. You can also ask your power company to put you on a list for priority power restoration. Remember, when it comes to surviving disasters, it's not about luck, it's about being prepared and having a plan. For more information on how you can prepare for disasters, visit news.caloes.ca.gov. For everyone at Cal OES, I'm Brittany Peterson.